the second of our title fights here at Fight UK 6. I'm Ben Cartledge, with me David Letherby. The amateur featherweight belt on the line as Lewis Gannon from Gannon's Black Belt Academy takes on Sean Kelly from UTC. Kelly in the black and white bad boy shorts and Gannon straight in for the takedown and a huge slam. Gannon now inside control. Kelly possibly a pretty shock up by that then definitely that early in the round it was a huge takedown Gannon known for his tough wrestling we've seen him in the fights that he's had in Fight UK before utilised some great wrestling some good game planning Kelly himself shown good wrestling for me Dave both of these things with these fighters is they're both undefeated both of them know how to win and neither of them will want to lose especially not with a title on the line Sean Kelly's done well to get back to his feet an orthodox clinch position now looking to real, get some knees on the inside real dangerous position for both fighters this neither really in a position should a good knee come straight through the middle to do a lot from an avoidance with both their arms being tied up as Gannon separates oh and a nice shot from Kelly there a short chopping right hand I think that hurt his opponent lovely chopping right he looks to work that dirty boxing but as I say that Gannon pulls the plum tie clinch nice shot on the break from the clinch so often we see that Dave the importance of fighters throwing a shot on the break Kelly threw a nice Chris Bryuk and there's another shoot for the takedown didn't really set it up as well as his earlier one which is probably why he's not having as much success coupled with a good sprawl from Kelly yeah Kelly's definitely open to that attack now from Gannon he's aware of the wrestling prowess and he's changed his stance accordingly a nice shot over the top from Kelly I think there's a home for that right hand he's found it a couple of times beautiful That's sprawl a really deep sprawl and so often we see David's giving him the ability the opportunity to take the back of his opponent and with Gannon turtled up and there he takes the back and he's got the arm locked up that was cerebral the way he took the back as you can see he's got the right arm pinned through with his right hook there this is a bad situation for Lewis Gannon to be in as he looks to isolate the other arm this is some fantastic grappling, Dave, from Sean Kelly. Beautiful work from Kelly, Ben. Looks for the choke. He's gone palm to palm. He's pulling that choke on tight. That looks tight. And there's the tap. There is the tap from Sean Kelly. For me, Dave, the second he took that back, it was an effortless, effortless transition as he isolated the arm as he came through it as well. What a fantastic finish from Sean Kelly, your new amateur featherweight champion. Fantastic performance from Kelly. The massive slam from Gannon at the start of the round, I think, took him back a bit. He didn't know where to go from there, worked his way back up to the feet. And then he showed an excellent sprawl, so he learned from that takedown. And as you alluded to, Gannon wasn't really setting it up like he did in that initial point. Snake round to get the back, and from there, it was the beginning of the end. Fantastic performance from Kelly.
here at Fire UK 6 with the new Fire UK Amateur Featherweight Champion, Sean Kelly. Sean, what a fight that was. Gannon coming out with a big takedown. Did he surprise you with his wrestling early on? Uh, I knew Gannon was a good wrestler. He actually surprised me with how strong and tight he was when he got me on the floor. But I knew he's a bit of a front runner, as in he'll come out really heavy, but then he'll back up. So my plan was as soon as he backs off, get straight back on him and get in his face and fight up. And that, the way you took his back, that was really, really slick. Is that something you've been working on and training, the way you took his back and you had the arm isolated as well? Um, as Gano as a wrestler, to be honest, I didn't really do any specific training. I just trained my fitness as much as I could. So that was a game plan to put the pressure on him. Well, that's fantastic. And uh, is there anybody you'd like to thank for, uh, for this title and for what this means to you? Uh, I'd like to thank all my fans that are in the crowd. Everybody just wish me good luck. Uh, USN, bad boy. UTC, the Lloyd Shorts, the Bout, all my training partners, Rich Hall for pushing my cardio, and all the rest of the coaches and training partners. That's fantastic. Sean Kelly here at Fight UK 6, your new featherweight champion.